Hi guys, it's me, Shania, your bestie. So, today we are going to read a story and discuss a small little thing. So, without wasting any time, let's begin this video. Guys, I have a question for you. Are you ever ashamed by your parents when they are not able to speak English? If you are not, that's good. But guys, if you are, as your bestie, I am saying that please not be. Because they put all the effort to teach us English. We should be grateful that we are studying in an English medium school. So they don't know that's what teaching us. They are teaching us so that we gain knowledge. So we should always be grateful for them and always thank them to like do so much things for us. So we are going to discuss this with a short story. The Loving Parents Audi grew up in a small village in Germany. His parents did not want the same farmer's life for their only son. Sacrificing all their needs and desires, they saved money to send Odi to study in England. Study really has son and make us proud, said the father. Odi was thrilled and said, Yes, father, I will. And Odi left for England. After four months, Odi returned home with three friends for Christmas. Father, I have invited my friends from school for Christmas. This is John, this is Peter, and this is David, said Odi, introducing his friends to his father. In chorus, they all said, Hello, Mr. Lee. Odi's parents did not know English. The only language they spoke was German. And so, Odi's father stood there and just smiled. Odi's friends found that strange. They made fun of his parents. Odi was lost in his friendship. He did not see clearly what was right and what was wrong. After a few days, Odi's friends left. Odi was very upset. He shouted at his parents, You could not speak English to my friends because you don't know English? Who doesn't know English? It is so shameful. Now they will go back to school and tell everybody how illiterate you are. Odi's parents were hurt and wept in secret. One day, Odi fell ill. He sent a message to his friends, hoping they would come see him. But nobody came. Odi's parents took care of him. They loved him fed him and gave him medicines. The medicines were so expensive that the father sold his watch to buy them. When Odi found it, he felt ashamed of himself. He went to his parents and cried, I am so sorry, father, mother. I am so ashamed of myself. You two always loved me, cared for me sent me to England to study and I forgot who I was and where I came from. Please forgive me, father. Please forgive me. Father hugged his son and said, We all make mistakes. Son, you should know we will always love you and will always be there for you. Odia grew up to be an engineer and invited his parents to stay in England with him. He took care of him and gave them all that they desired. And guys, before I say the moral of the story, 
I would like to say that we should not make friends that are like your parents don't know English. I will not be friendship with you. We should not make friends like this and we should also not behave like this. We should make a friend who always trusts us, I mean respect the elders. Because respecting the elders is most important since they do anything for us. So guys, the moral of this story is parents will always love you unconditionally and will never leave your side even when the world comes to an end. Always, always respect them and love them back. Guys, let me explain this story a little bit. So, Ori was a kid who grew up in a small village in Germany. His parents were farmers, so his parents didn't want Odi to just uh, live the same farmer's life for their only son. So, sacrificing all their needs and desires, they saved money to send Odi to England. The father said, Steady really hard, son, and make us proud. Odi was very happy and thrilled, and he said, Yes, father. I will. After four months, Odi returned to home after going from England. He went to England and then he came back after four months. And also invited three friends for Christmas. So he was introducing his friends to his father. That father, I've invited my friends from school for Christmas. Christmas. So he was introducing his friends to his father. That father, I've invited my friends from school for Christmas. This is John, this is Peter and this is David. Said Odi introducing to his friends. In chorus they all said hello, uh, Mr. Lee. Odi's parents did not know English. The only language they spoke was German because they used to live in Germany. Odi's father was just smiling at them. Odi's friends were finding it a little strange. Like, why is he smiling to us? Like, can't he say hi? So, Odi was like literally lost in his friendship and he was like uh, just caring about his friends and he was not able to see that what is right and what is wrong. So, Odi was very upset. After their, I mean, his parents left, Odi was so upset that he shouted at his parents. You could not talk to my friends because you don't know English. Who doesn't know English? It is so shameful. It's so shameful. They will go back to school and tell how like illiterate you are. How you can't speak English. Odi's parents were very sad. They like they were hurt and they wept in secret. But one day Odi fell ill. So he just sent his uh, the message to his friends hoping they would come and just care for him. But nobody came. Odi's parents took a lot of care from him, for him, fed him and gave him medicines. But guys, the medicines were so expensive that the father sold his watch. Sold his watch to buy them. When Odi found it that... Uh, uh, I mean, his father sold his watch. He was so ashamed of himself and cried and went to his parents. I'm so sorry, father and mother, uh, for behaving like this to you. You two always loved me, cared for me, always supported me, uh, sent me to England to study hard and I forgot where I came from and who I was. Please forgive me. Please forgive me, Father. Odi said to his parents. Her, I mean, his father hugged his son and said, We all make mistakes, son. You should know. We will always love you and will always be there for you. Odi's father said and hugged him. Odi grew up and became an engineer and invited his parents to stay in England with him and he took care of them and gave all the things they desired.
so guys now it is time to end this video i hope all of you enjoyed this video